the officers of the group of Soviet troops in Germany were the first to actively import this model. Most often there are opal record with the sedan body, less often, station wagons, very rarely, a coupe. Standing apart, the Commodore model differed from the record with a six-cylinder engine and a set of bells and whistles. In October 1982, the record E was upgraded, during which the grille, headlights, and hood were changed, and the bumpers and rear became less angular. Now record is less and less common on our market. Corrosion mows down the rows of cars, the body resists it rather weakly. At the same time, the quality of painting is quite high, so that on a considerable part of the copies the factory paintwork has been preserved even today. The sick, almost incurable, place of the body is the front suspension cups, which quickly crack if you drive with leaky racks on broken roads. Inside the car, five people fit comfortably, in the back seat and the legs are spacious, and in the shoulders. The decoration is made in the style of the 70s. In the driver's seat, the dimensions of the car are well felt, a long hood, a comfortable fit. The ride is smooth and soft, the dynamics of the car with our most famous gasoline engines, 2.0 and 2.2 liters, is quite decent. Non-turbo diesels are frankly rather weak. The turbocharged 2.3D version is rare. Gasoline units, except for 1.8 liters, all injection, did not differ in efficiency, 12 to 14 liters per 100 kilometers. For this reason, the aforementioned diesel modifications are still in demand. In general, motors have a resource of 250 to 300,000 kilometers, although they sin at the same time with branded defects, failure of hydraulic valve lifters and wear of the camshaft, occurrence of piston rings, fragility of the pump and warping of the cylinder head when overheated. It should be noted that most of the record have already experienced an engine overhaul, so you should not expect German reliability from these units. All records were rear-wheel drive, and the workshops speak positively of the transmission. The most common five-speed gearboxes do not cause problems, the driveline and rear axle gearbox work just as smoothly. The chassis of this large and comfortable car is designed for smoother roads than most Ukrainian ones. Record owners who hauled heavy loads sometimes beefed up the rear springs. If you are going to buy such instances, like cars with a tow bar, you need to carefully examine the condition of the clutch. Our pits and potholes reduce the life of the steering tips and shock absorbers, but the ball bearings and silent blocks have a large margin of safety. Since this model is inexpensive in our country, its owners, poor people, sometimes, during repairs, adapted spare parts from domestic cars for Opel. The probability of acquiring such a record cannot be discounted either. There are enough spare parts for this model at the disassembly, but they come there mainly from the same machines that have already served their purpose and you should not count on their long service. Opel Record E is a car for those who want to buy a spacious foreign car for little money and agree to put up with the prospect of more and more frequent repairs and spending on spare parts.